Have you told Ida about your decision to leave? Shh. I... I'm not ready yet. I'm not sure how she'll react. <sighs> Everyone's leaving, huh? Even King. I guess I'm no substitute for the real thing. So why are you suddenly so interested in flying? Did you give up on returning to the human realm? I mean, I suppose you can stay here a, a little longer. Ida, King's still waiting to talk to you. Uh, maybe later. Okay, well, maybe at the Grand Prix? I'll be there, I promise. Stay away from me! me! Ida! I'm so glad you made it. I, uh, would really like to tell you something before the race starts. If it's so important, we can talk about it after the race. When you win, okay? Uh, yeah, yeah, okay. Up the Emperor, right? Then we play on! Ida, do you have kids? Uh, but they're not mine. Mine. Oh, it doesn't matter. They both have real families to return to. No, this isn't over. Ida, who's even gonna watch this? No one watches Crystal Balls anymore. It's all about streaming. All right. <clears throat> Hi, Dad. If you're out there watching this, I, uh, want to introduce myself. I like cheesy foods and conquering kingdoms, though I haven't conquered any of my own yet. But maybe you have, and we can compare notes. I'd love to meet you. We could do parent-kid stuff. Toss a ball, burn some cookies, catch me going on weird websites or something. Also, I found this symbol in the tower I hatched it. Maybe you can teach me to read it? I live with my favorite human and a cranky old witch. Hey! But, cranky or not, she's the one who raised me. Which is why I am legally changing my name to King Clawthorn! <laughs> Surprise, Ida! Now we're connected for life and there's nothing you can do about it! Is that what you wanted to tell me this whole time? And if you sign here, it'll be official. <laughs> Ida, are, are you okay? 